Hey, in this video, let's go ahead and take a quick look at the difference between automatic UVs and using auto seams, right? So I have this older model uh, that I did a while ago and I just opened it up and this is a great model to show um, the difference between the two. So for example, I'm gonna select this model and I'm gonna go to UV uh, editor and you can see the old UVs that I had uh, created in the past, right? And let's say for whatever reason, I let's say I'm happy with the skin layout, but I'm not happy with his little stone. So he's kind of a rock crystal guy, right? So you could see that um, this uh, these have been unfolded in relatively unappealing way. So let's see if there's a, a better way of doing this. So for this example, what I'm going to do is I'm going to double click on my character. I'm going to select his eyes. I'm going to press H. To hide him and now what I would like to do I also am going to hide my lights so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to face mode select all of these crystals and let's look at the difference between the two so if I go to UV and say automatic UVs I get something like this if I press W I can move this aside and take a look and you know you could say that this is definitely really nice and uh, it will work really well for texturing but maybe there is a better way to unfold these instead of having this many uh, pieces. What if we want the crystals to actually stay intact and we don't want them separated in a bunch of little pieces, right? Um, for that, what I'm gonna do is let's reset our seams. So I'm just gonna go to um, my Z axis and just completely reset it. Go to press W and move it aside. And this time, instead of pressing automatic let's go ahead and try auto seams so i'm going to press that as soon as i do you can see that uh, the auto seam lines have been created on these crystals now if i go to face mode and select them i can of course unfold and then i can do unstack and you can see that this is a much different uh, way of unfolding something like these crystals so this would be useful for maybe uh, hair as well if you have a hair pieces from zbrush or you have many different elements in my opinion this seems uh, like a much better uh, unfolding than what i had previously so now of course i can just uh, put them in in their place and um, continue with my um, texture so i hope you found this video useful thank you for watching and i'll see you next one